Hey, Reg, those uh, core relays we saw on the way here must have been cracked by all that destruction. This one's sealed up pretty tight. I doubt the DUP is going to let you borrow their keys. You're probably going to have to break them open. Oh, look, I just happen to have some mad new breaking skills. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Look out below! Not bad, huh? Hey, you want to see it again? Man, how many DUP guys are in this city? Yeah, well, luckily you have the advantage in numbers, my man. Uh, how do you figure that? Well, because one person can move around faster, lighter, quieter. Plus, it'll make them underestimate you. Not gonna know what hit them. You wanna do me a favor and explain that to them, so maybe they'll just give up? Why? Spoil the surprise when it happens. <laughs> Good point. Checkpoints and cameras on just about every corner. That's the benefit of having home field advantage. Except this isn't their home field. Try telling them that. Okay, so that way is not an option. It's better work. It freaking worked! I tell you, man, think at the rate I'm going with the powers thing, I'm like one, maybe two away from storming her castle. Okay, why don't we slow down there, hotshot? I mean, she just destroyed an entire concrete and steel bridge, you remember? Right, so you're thinking 
one more is not gonna do it. What I'm thinking. Reg, man, you should see this place. It's completely deserted. No ferries going in or out or... Same thing at the airport and train station. Now that they got the bridge out, the DUP's got this town sealed tight. This is not gonna be easy, is it? That's too bad I didn't think to mention that to you, over. You think the DUP does this to every town they get called to? Apparently, that's what they say. Why do people even put up with that? Because when it comes down to it, most folks aren't willing to trade life for liberty or the pursuit of happiness. Nah, that can't be it. No second-hand smoke is bad for you. Reggie, I've used up all the core relays you sent, man. Come on, any more? No, man, that's all you get. I mean, this bioterrorist thing has you all worked up. You, you need to find some place to lay low and chill out for a while. What is it with you and laying low? I'm fine. I'm great. Give me more. No. Now, I'm working on a possible lead with a detective on the SPD. But we're not moving forward Suck so on this. your head's on straight. Okay, okay, I'll lay low. Whatever the hell that means. idea where this central communication thing is? Well, you did say you wanted to see it while you were here. Shut up, Space Needle? Space Needle.
Keeping Toms. and an aerosol can. Okay, Reg, I'm here and you were right. The needle's tricked out with all kinds of electrical crap and what looks like a bad aluminum siding job. You're gonna have to get to the top of the needle. It's a nice day, I'll just climb to the top. Climb. No, 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 don't be crazy. Right, hey man, it's not crazy to be awesome. Hey Reg, hypothetical, you know, theoretical, totally what if question here, but what would be the explanation for how I might be able to draw the power from some conduits, say, oh, I don't know, Hank, and not others, like one of these dupe troopers? Oh my god, so you did try earlier. Hey, I'm not looking for an I told you so here, Reg. I'm just looking for an answer. The dupes had those things locked down. Well, I suppose that 
hypothetically, theoretically, it could be you can only drain powers from a conduit who has them naturally? A prime conduit, like Hank, or hopefully Augustine. And the DUP guys got all their weaker powers from Augustine, so maybe they can't pass them on. Even to you. So you're saying we have to keep going. Read you loud and clear. Don't push it. And next time, don't... Man, this stuff's even uglier from the inside. Looking forward to taking this stuff down. Hey there. It's Betty. Where are you? Oh, hi, Betty. I'm at the Space Needle. Oh, I'll, I'll try back later then. Bring me a postcard. <laughs> okay, if the gift shop's open. Bye, Betty. Bye, bye, dear. This is more like it. I'm on the uh, observation deck. Don't let your guard down. Relax. Well, onward and upward. Keep going. You're almost to the top. Alright, time to gouge out the eye of the needle. And that must be what holds it all together. What the hell? Well, I haven't seen you before. Rex, man, they got a small army up here. Good. They're in the right place. Or that they really don't like other people playing with their stuff. Come on, focus, Delson. Do you see any way to take down the communications? Yeah, yeah, there's this uh, anchor. Looks like it's holding all the antennas in place. I don't think this is gonna cut. Nothing bad ever came from getting new powers. Oh, this is going to be epic! See? That wasn't so bad. Yeah. Isn't that better? Woo! That's a rush. It goes away. Hello, 
Science Center District. I lost you. Did you read me? I'm getting nothing, sir. You? Nothing outside our immediate area. Yeah, Reg. Let's go find us some prime conduits and get some new powers. We own the streets! Take it easy. A few streets. In the immediate vicinity. Right? The DUP still owns the other 98%. But we kicked them off the Space Needle, man! You knocked out their comm center, okay? They may be deaf, but they're not dumb. Kicking the DUP completely out of Seattle is gonna take time. We just got here. You know what they say. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single kick-ass tag. Who, who says that? The Chinese people. Hey, Reg. Let me see it from down there. <laughs> Are you kidding? People in Portland can see it. I just want to let the dupes know I'm here, man. Who the hell is that? That's not one of the three who escaped. It's cool. What's the symbol supposed to be? Not sure. The banner may have got away before the Duke reinforced. Delson, I've been asking around about the escaped bioterrorists. Do you think I maybe need like a PR guy? Oh, people here are starting to call me the Banner Man, which, A, is unbelievably lame. Uh, maybe not the best idea, you hanging around the Space Needle right now? Well, I mean, why not Smoke-tastic Man, or, or, hell, just the Smoker? Look, I'll keep trying to get a lead on the escape bioterrorists. Why don't you see if you can disrupt other DUP operations around there until I get back to you? Yeah, who's this? Raymond Wolf, the reporter. Whoa, like the Raymond Wolf, the, the the guy who cracked the military's real involvement with the Empire City catastrophe? Good, you've heard of me. That'll make this easier. I need your help. Get to Sundial Park, and I'll tell you more about it. 